everyone I'm Nancy welcome to my channel I am super excited to have you join me again tonight I will be doing another plan with me video this will be for the week from December 30th through January 5th and although I call my memory planning because I had pictures from my past and present that I want to remember and just share memories I actually am doing this from memory so that is what most people mean when they say memory planning so anyway before I get too much into it, I just want to thank you all for joining me. To my subscribers, my viewers, thank you so much. It means the world to me to have you here and your support just means the world to me. If you are new to my channel, I hope that you click on that little red subscribe button over there. I would love to have you come back and join me. I hope everyone gives this video a thumbs up and kind of lets them move along. I'm going to try to do these a little bit faster than I normally do, though I suppose the first of the month, there's some extra pictures that go along with it. So, uh, January for me is a big month. It's our anniversary month and this would have been our 44th wedding anniversary. So I just put a big, big picture here of Rick. I met him the day after I graduated from high school and he had just come home from the service. So he had just uh, finished his uh, tour and he was back in the States and just happened to meet him while applying for a job. I didn't get that job by the way but I did get him uh, January is also my mom's birthday month so I've got a picture of my mom and my dad uh, they're both dancing at our wedding I put a picture of them of my mom and my dad my sister Linda and me this is probably the early 70s as you can probably tell from the hairstyles and uh, we we're in upstate New York my uh, great aunt Margie uh, lived in New York up in the Catskill Mountains and um, we just always used to love going there and that was my mom and dad's dream when they retired to move to upstate New York unfortunately my dad passed um, before he had a chance to retire and by the time my mom retired a few years later she was like I don't want to go to New York I don't know anybody in New York anymore so she moved to Arizona don't know why um, that's a picture of um, um, I'm all dressed up for a wedding up my books are falling over on me and my bridesmaids my maid of honor so I've got my sister here my sister Linda uh, my sister-in-law Derry she was the maid of honor and we've got some friends from high school uh, Linda and Karen Nordberg sisters they were really fun and Heather Ronshaw she was a friend of the family for years from my husband's family for years he had known her since she was just an infant she was a flower girl and then I just got a picture of us at our wedding day and then a picture of us riding the bike out in Sturgis. Well, I'm not, I'm just the passenger. I made a good designated passenger. So that was my January, uh, welcome to January page. And then I'll probably just go back and fill this in probably at the end of the year. But this is a kit from Stickadelic for the month of January. And it comes also with a lot more stickers that you can put in for uh, the days of the month and some pictures and uh, these little star things to, uh, do the days of the uh, week so I will probably go back and do that at some point so I am actually using a mini kit from one of the uh, subscription boxes that I got on that I ordered on Black Friday so this is from Planner Envy and the mini kit had just these two pages so I've never done a kit with just two pages before so we are going to need a lot of help these are the two pages on this so we do have some um, some pictures to put in some full boxes they're going to have to be cut because they're not going to quite fit in here and just some boxes that maybe I can use some of them I know I'm going to be using those so we'll see what we can get from this I don't have a lot of pictures that I pulled out but I do have Sabrina and the jelly beans and Mike they kind of all put on their funny 2020 glasses so we'll use that for New Year's that's a picture of Rena and Jeremy Maddie Matt and Jeffrey just all together so I thought that would be a good picture and for our wedding day I just got a picture of my dad and myself that I'll put down on the third for us and then my weight and remember when I said when I left I was 107.9 or 107.8 or whatever and I said remember that because that's gonna change so that was on December 19th and when I came home I was a whopping 120 pounds so I didn't really care about too much what I ate, but I don't think I really overate that much or really drank a lot other than, you know, the scorpion bowl and some things here and there. But I didn't have the activity that I have. And I think even though uh, Rainer and I went to the gym three days and I did use her, her under desk elliptical one day and we did some walking when we went shopping, it just wasn't the same. When I'm sitting at my desk at work and I use the elliptical for four, five, six hours a day, that really helps speed up my metabolism. So you can see just going 
um, just over a week, a week and a half without that elliptical, how much that changed because my metabolism really, really changed. So anyway, these are the items that I'm going to be using this week. And I'm going to shut the camera off. I'm going to fill in some of the basic. Oh, and washi, because I have, this doesn't come with any washi or date covers. So I'll just leave the, uh, the dates as they are. I have no idea what I want to use for washi yet. So I just kind of grabbed an, assoit, an assortment, assortment. And so I will be using some kind of probably these. I might reach in for something else, but we'll see how it goes. And I will be right back. decided to go ahead and fast forward it. Um, all the uh, boxes, the full boxes that came with that kit were just way too big for the horizontal planner. So I shut the camera off and I just went ahead and trimmed them down and inserted them where I wanted to. As long as I was doing that, I figured I might as well put in the pictures that I wanted to add in. And um, just so anyway, I've got my uh, temperature in already. I've got the elliptical steps and the hours and the miles that I put in, the steps from my uh, Fitbit. So I did those in from after I got home. I didn't bother to do it on the days that I was traveling. So getting on to Monday. So Monday I was originally, I was supposed to uh, fly home um, probably around, I think I had a flight around five or six o'clock at night and I would be getting home from the airport after a layover probably about one or two in the morning. That flight was canceled as Minneapolis was having a snowstorm. So my flight was rebooked until the next day. So actually I got to spend another day with everyone. So I got to actually watch the jelly beans on Monday as Sabrina had a doctor's appointment. Maddie Matt stayed over and hung out with me so that we watched the uh, jelly beans together, had all kinds of fun. So now let's get into Tuesday and the rest of the week. Alrighty, so on to uh, Tuesday. So I'm just uh, filling in there that, you know, my flight had been rescheduled. I knew I was going to have some time at the airport uh, waiting, which is okay. It's, you just have to kind of go along with the flow when you're traveling in the winter. But anyway, while I was uh, at that first airport on my layover, I went online and uh, Raina had the best sheets that she got from QVC. And I thought the ones I had from last year from QVC from Berkshire were, bit, were, were great, but they came out with an even better thicker blanket type one. It's velvety soft. I love it. Um, I had them at Raina's, decided I needed to have it when I got home. So I went on a line at QVC. I ordered them. They, she also had some pillows from Uggs um, called Kukla Berra or Kula Berra. And I went online to a couple of different places and Kohl's actually had the best price. So I ordered one from Kohl's as well. It wasn't going to be home until a few days after I got home, but I figured I could live with it. I also added a New Year's Eve sticker. I put um, some foiled airplanes on Monday where my flight was canceled. And then again on Tuesday where it was rescheduled. I put a little quarter box that I'm going to put a little sticker in on Tuesday. And then I put right under that. Uh, less adulting, more coffee, because at the airport it was going to be a long day. I was going to be having a lot of coffee to stay awake. Um, on to New Year's Day. So I added that January 1st sticker that came with the kit. And there was a, I was really surprised. There were a few stores that were still open. I didn't think anything was going to be open. But I wanted to get some more coffee. And I went to Colburn's. They have, uh, it's a local grocery chain around me and they have their own uh, coffee like in a k-cup and it's a caramel one and it is so good it's 80 calories but it is so good so i wanted to pick up another box i needed some cold meds so i used that little rx uh bottle over there the little uh shopping girl from planner kate 
The liquor store was open, so I got some champagne. Um, it was a laundry day because it was like my first full day home, even though I really didn't have a lot of laundry to do because while I was at Raina's, Raina and Jeremy did my laundry. And when I was at Sabrina's, Sabrina did my laundry. So I just had a few things to do. So that was really cool. Um, I also came home and I was watching Home Shopping Network. And oops, I bought a Pilates reformer. Never done that before. But um, it just looked like it was going to be something really interesting because I really need to work on toning. So I've actually got it. I set it up by myself. I've used it a few times. I love it. I will have to try to show a video of, of it. It's in the middle of my living room, by the way. So I just have to try to figure out the camera angle to uh, get that in there. So anyway, on to Thursday. So it's back to work, and I used uh, that little quarter box there that came with the kit that I'm working with. And I put a little sticker on it, um, work, even though I go to work every day. I just thought it would kind of look funny, kind of look cute. And then um, when I get out of work, I'm using another little quarter box that has some nice dressy shoes on it. And I decided I could not wait for that pillow that I had ordered online. So I went to Kohl's to see if they had it at the store, but they didn't have it at the store. But while I was there, I looked around for a while. I tried on some sweaters and some, some dress locks and just could not find anything that was jumping at me. So anyway, on to um, Friday. So I was just kind of feeling miserable. Everybody was kind of going out after work again to kind of go out for a couple of drinks or whatever. Um, I just was not, not up to it. I got a cold when I was gone this time. Usually it waits till a few days after I got home, but I got uh, the cold while I was in Massachusetts. So I used that the little half box that says, uh, don't forget, just because I needed a, a box to put there. I put the TGIF sticker and then I used the uh, Planner Kate Friday Girl. And then I used another quarter box under it that had some balloons on it. And from the last, um, the items that I got from Jump To It Designs, I think they have a little character that they call popcorn or whatever. So it's got this little guy like lying down on his pillow with his uh, computer and some popcorn. And I used another sticker called Netflix and Chill. I came home, I just made a cup of coffee. I put some whipped cream on it. And then I went to bed. I took some cold medicine. I put Netflix on and I ended up watching a whole series called Virgin River. Really nice series. I can't wait to see season two on that. Um, I woke up Saturday and just was still kind of feeling yucky, but I knew I should go to work to try to catch up. So I used another quarter box. I put work in there, a little work sticker. I went to work from 12 to 6. Then I used another one of those quarter boxes and I used that popcorn character again doing some laundry. I really didn't have a lot of laundry to do, but I just wanted to try to keep up with it. Sometimes, you know, I just uh, like to do small loads and just to have it done quick. I used another quarter box, even though it's uh, probably one. It's got some silverware there like dinner, but you know I had something to eat. And I put the little uh, Playing With Me sticker um, on that because I wanted to start working on uh, a Play With Me video because I'm so far behind. I also got this uh, planner sticker that looks really cute from Sugary Gal Pop. So I put that in the uh, full box next to it and um, on to Sunday. So I'm putting that little uh, half box there. I wanted to go to work again. So I used a quarter box for the work, and then I used that GP Studios a work sticker again. I went to work from about 1 to 6. After that, I did a quick little Target run. So I'm going to use my uh, the bigger Target shopping girl that I got from uh, Planner Kate. And I went to Target. I needed to get some more cold meds, and I wanted to get some Kleenex because... Well, some Puffs Plus with a lotion, but then I saw that they had Puffs Plus with Vicks in it. So I bought that kind because, it, oh my God, that just really felt good with the cold to just kind of breathe that Vicks in, just kind of helped clear everything out. So I'm opening up the book to show you where I am. And so I either lost my footage or I forgot to hit print record. I'm thinking I forgot to hit record. So anyway, I went through, I got some stickers and I ended up finishing this page. And so um, hopefully that means it will be a quick video for you to uh, watch. So anyway, for Monday, I put this uh, lazy day couch on. That was part of the kit that I used last week or two weeks ago. 
I got a little sticker that says family time, little gold uh, foiled lips, and then a sparkle and shine, and I put that over a uh, quarter box. Going down to Tuesday, I added New Year's Eve. I put in this little half box. I put in cheers because I was going to be drinking a lot of coffee at the airport till I got home. I put on less uh, talky, more coffee, and then count down to midnight. For January 1st, for New Year's Day, I added this. I don't know if I had that in already. I put in the uh, little shopper girl. I did the uh, prescription things, even though it was just over the cold meds. And I put in new you, new you. I thought it said something else, but new you, and then the laundry day. And I did right here a, a New Year's banner. Uh, for Thursday, even though it was like my back to work day, I put in, uh, but first coffee, cause I needed some coffee. Um, and we did this uh, little uh, half box here and I put in a fresh start. Going over to Friday, let's see. I think we probably had everything down here with the half boxes and the TGIF, the Friday, the little popcorn guy um, having uh, watching his Netflix and chill. For Saturday, I think I just ordered that other little, didn't order, I just uh, put that little other planner in there. As you can see, I laid down the washi and it's doing that same thing. It's just coming up all over the place. So can't wait to close this book and check it back check on it again tomorrow um, I think everything else was already there when I left um, on here on the bottom I added for the goals week goals this week this was in that kit that I just used I added water because I need to get back on my track of drinking water because I didn't drink a lot of water again uh, fitness that's my goal I can and I did I lost six pounds um, in the week that I came back. So I weighed myself when I came back um, Tuesday night. So from Tuesday to Sunday, I did lose six pounds. And I think that had a lot to do with using the elliptical. I used it at home even on uh, New Year's Day. So I got right back into using the elliptical because I had, you know, just uh, some days, you know, just, uh, just couldn't get my groove, I guess, because I only had like two and a half miles here, 2.7 miles here. But I think I'm going to get back into it slowly, losing that six pounds off the first week back, just drinking water again, getting into the uh, the exercise routine with this. Um, and just, uh, this is, you know, my goal right here is that I'm striving for, pro I'm striving for progress, not perfection so I just think that is a perfect sticker because you know taking care of our health doesn't mean that we want to be this uh, of course it would be nice if you know could turn into this uh, perfect uh, gorgeous person but not possible when you you know start out looking like me so I just want to strive for progress I want to know that I'm going in the right direction I want to stay motivated and when I do go home or go out to eat and get off track I want to know that I can just get myself motivated faded again to get right back on track and so I think with that elliptical and then I did order that uh, Pilates reformer and that seems to be a lot of fun so I've been doing that a couple of nights a week as well trying to get some toning and some strength back and burning some calories so that is my planner this week so it's got a little bit of foiling in it not as much and uh Anyway, I want to thank everyone for joining me again. I really enjoy doing these, even though I didn't really get to share my doing it with you. But, you know, and maybe that's the way that I should go. Maybe I should just go ahead and do it and then film the after effects and just kind of point out the different things that I put down. So we'll have to think about that in the future. So let me know your comments if that works better instead of just seeing everything in fast motion. If it's just easier to just kind of go through it at the end and just you know point out the elliptical steps or the temperature and what my goals were or my tasks were for the day so anyway i'm starting to ramble because i'm getting tired and i just want to thank everyone for joining me i hope you go out and have a fantastic week we'll chat again soon don't forget to give me a thumbs up even if you don't like it, it doesn't hurt me to give me a, a thumbs up let me know you've been here Alrighty, thanks everyone talk to you soon bye bye